So the next thing that happened on Monday Night Raw, we had the main event. But before we talk about the main event, we're going to talk about the next round of the draft and what happened backstage. So yeah, we had uh, Byron Saxon. He was interviewing the WWE Raw Women's Champion, Bianca Belair. She was talking about how even though she's going to be on the blue brand, she'll always miss the red brand and all that stuff. But Backlash, she'll retain her title and beat EO Sky. But then she gets interrupted by Bailey, Dakota Kai, and EO Sky damage control. And Bailey was somehow like, you know, her and Dakota picked up the win tonight on Raw, and that EO will become the new uh, Raw Women's Champion at Backlash and all that stuff. And yeah, um, Bianca was talking about how she knows how good EO is, and that Dakota and Bailey's the ones holding her back and all that stuff. And um, EO say something in Japanese, and then um, Dakota and then was going to translate it and stuff. But Bianca was like, it's all good. I already know me and EO understands each other. And they stared at each other. So, yeah, that's what happened there. And then we get to the next draft. It was the fifth round of the WWE draft. We had Teddy Long representing SmackDown, JBL representing Raw right here for the draft. And, yeah, um, the first person in the fifth round of getting getting drafted to Monday Night Raw was Chad Gable and Otis Alpha Academy. So yeah, Alpha Academy will stay on Monday Night Raw. Um, Rick Boogs will be going to Friday Night SmackDown. He was the next one drafted. The next one drafted to Monday Night Raw was actually from NXT. Katana Chance and uh, Caden Carter, they'll be getting drafted from NXT to Monday Night Raw, and it's kind of insane because I was thinking that they was going to be the ones winning the NXT Women's Tag Team Championships tomorrow night on NXT, just because uh, Alba Fire and Isla Dawn will be going to SmackDown stuff, but apparently we're going to have to see what actually happens because now they're getting drafted to Monday Night Raw. Maybe the titles will become vacant. We, we, we'll see. But yeah, they're they're getting drafted to Monday Night Raw. And the final pick that's getting drafted to Friday Night SmackDown is Cameron Grimes from NXT. So yeah, Cameron Grimes will be going to Friday Night SmackDown. That was the end of the draft for tonight. But yeah, we get to the main event. Seth Rollins versus Solo Sokoa with Paul Heyman at ringside. This match, it was a pretty good match. It was going back and forth and everything. At one point, we see Solo hit spinning Solo onto Seth Rollins. He pins him, but Seth barely kicking out to uh, Rollins was talking a lot of crap to Solo, talking about how uh, he's Roman's a little bitch and all that stuff, and Solo gets mad, picks him up and hits a second, um, you know, spinning Solo onto Seth Rollins, and then Solo's just beating him down and everything. They go outside the ring going at it, and Seth pushes him to the ring post and stuff and throws him back into the ring, hits a forearm onto him, spins him around, hits a second forearm to the back of the head and stuff. And then we see Jimmy and Jay, the Usos, coming up attacking Seth Rollins, which caused a disqualification. So yeah, Seth Rollins defeated Solo Sokoa by DQ, and the Usos, the Solo is beating down Seth Rollins. And then we see the undisputed WWE Tag Team Champions, Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens, and Matt Riddle coming down, uh, making the save, brawling with the bloodline. So yeah, and Raw just goes off with everybody brawling so yeah that's what happened there uh for the match and what happened after the match i'll give it three stars that's why i'll give it it was a pretty good match between seth and solo and stuff but yeah end in dq match of the night for me i would say it was a six person tag team match with the lwo versus the judgment day so yeah but yeah for tonight's episode of monday night raw with the draft i'll say i'll give it seven and a half stars because the draft but, yeah, that's the end of the draft right there. And then, yeah, um, that is my Monday Night Raw reviews. Like, subscribe subscribe to Team W Wrestling on YouTube. Subscribe to my other channel, World of Chris. And subscribe to this channel, Chris Bales. And follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and both of my TikToks. It'll all be down there in the description box. And, yeah, I'll be doing my Friday Night Smackdown reviews this Friday night, which is the last Smackdown before Backlash doing my backlash reviews this saturday so yeah look out for that i'll be doing my backlash predictions sometime this week look out for that and AEW dynamite i'll be talking about that this wednesday so yeah uh, i'll see you guys later until then